Hi, this is Tara Morrison, OCC Consultant, with a look into Scribus and making interactive PDF files. I want to welcome you to this tutorial where you'll learn to use Scribus to transform a simple PDF document into an interactive PDF by adding PDF text fields, PDF checkboxes, and saving and testing your document. For demonstration purposes, I'm going to use a timesheet for a fictitious company the Valkyrie Foundation. We will start with this PDF document and step-by-step step modify it to create this interactive or fillable PDF. The most useful interactive tool is the PDF text box. This type of field allows text to be typed into it by the user. Let's go to my example document opened in Scribus and add fillable text boxes to areas where I want people to be able to enter text information. To do this, I select the Insert PDF Text field icon in the right-hand corner of the Scribus toolbar. You take the cursor to the area that you want it to cover, and you click the mouse, and you drag your field until it covers the area that you want it to cover. It's as easy as that. Repeat these steps for all other desired text entry areas. For the sake of time, I'll just jump ahead to a form where I've already done this. Notice that the fillable text boxes that I've created are highlighted for visibility. Another very useful tool is the fillable checkbox field. This type of field allows for checkboxes to be entered into it, and the procedure for creating it is very similar to the text boxes. This time, Select the Insert PDF checkbox icon from the right-hand corner of the Scribus bar. Again, move the cursor to the area that you want it to cover. Click and drag the cursor until it covers the area that you want the checkbox to appear in. And it's as easy as that. Again, Repeat these steps for each of your desired checkbox areas. For the Valkyrie example, this is the result. Notice again that the fillable checkboxes I've created are highlighted for you to see easily. The last step is to save and test your new PDF file to make sure it is ready for use. Now, save your work by selecting the Save as PDF icon in the Scribus toolbar. The Save as PDF pop-up has come up, and now I'm just going to change the name of my sheet. And I'll hit Save, and it's all done. Don't forget the importance of testing your document to make sure that it is fully functional. For this, you simply need to open your new PDF document and try it out. If each field accepts text, or checks appropriately, then you've been successful in creating your first interactive PDF document. Congratulations and well done. Now you're ready to go out and make lots of interactive PDFs to simplify your life.